Hello everyone, welcome to a new video. In today's video we are answering your questions about twins because we have quite a bit of first hand knowledge. knowledge. If you haven't noticed, we're twins. If you're new to the channel, welcome. How you doing? Please click subscribe, turn on post notifications, all that malarkey. Uh, if you're a recent subscriber, welcome. Thank you very much for subscribing, we really appreciate everyone who's doing that. We just hit 900 subscribers. Yeah, hit 900. 900. 900. 900. The big nine. Oh, the big oh. Um, maybe we'll get a plaque from YouTube. We won't, but uh. But anyway, enough about all that. You're here to learn about twins. Anything you want to know about twins, you've come to the right place. Oh, excuse me. Excuse me. Uh, I've got loads of questions about twins. Do you know how oh, to find? Oh, stop. Yeah. You're in the right place. Oh, perfect. Right here. <laughs> Guys, we're in the right place. Come on in. We're in the right place. I've just asked. I've just checked. Yeah. yeah. Get a notepad out, start making notes, because in today's class, it's Twins 101. So the first question from Katie Plaskett. Uh, by the way guys, Katie, I used to work with Katie, she has a TikTok and a YouTube. We'll put the links in the description, go check her out. So her question is, do you guys get compared a lot? Yes, yes. Uh, all the fucking time. I think it's a natural thing to just be like, are you as good as him? And my thought is, do you just grab random people and go, are you as good as him? No, you don't. I don't know why people do it with twins. Do yeah. you know why? Yeah, there's an assumption because you're identical, you're going to be the same in everything, so that's why they always ask. In school, for example, or like with sports, oh yeah, you're not as fast as your brother, and I'm not as fast as him either. But you're not telling me I'm not fast as him. But if you had two identically built factory toys, wind up toys, and you race them, you go, oh, why is that one faster? You compare them because they're identical. But if you had a cheetah next to a tortoise, you what wouldn't a compare stupid them. Thing to say. No, mate, actually, I'm 100% right. <laughs> Who was born first and how long apart was it? Him by a minute. This one's from Livy. Being a twin is like being born with a best friend. Do you agree? Get six marks. Oh, we'll you put... stole my joke. Oh, no, I'm saying that joke because that was my joke. Being a twin is like being born with a best friend. Do you agree? Sounds like a sounds like a GCSE English six marker or something, doesn't it? Yeah. Quite frankly, Livy. It is. <laughs> Am I your best friend? Am I your best friend? Honestly, I'm the Don't flatter yourself, mate. Don't flatter yourself. Do not flatter yourself. Well, you're more like always there. You're like, a, you're like a growth. You're like a sea urchin and I'm a rock. Not true. The harder you try to move it, the harder it is to get off. You're like the pollen from a flower. I'm the flower, you're the pollen. No one wants the pollen around and you irritate some people. You make them sniffly. What a stupid thing to say because without pollen, there wouldn't be any flower. Fine. I knew it as I was saying it. You're, you're like, like an old wrinkly mole. I said like, that at the like, beginning. No, you didn't. Or growth. You said growth. Slash mole, but... Okay, a new one. He's like a toy that you have when you're younger, and then when you grow up, you're like, oh, I wish I could get rid of that, but mum likes it because it reminds her of when we were a kid. So what I'll do, I'll put it in a drawer and never look at it again. And that's not true, is it? Very poor one. I'm like a lovely, relatively lovely, looking ice cream shaped poo, and you're the bad smell that comes with it. Without you, looks quite nice. But with you, mate, stinks. A good one. You're like a hangnail on the edge of your nail. Very painful while it's there, very annoying, painful to rip off, but once it's gone, you're bloody happy. You're bloody pleased it's gone. You're not. Open wound, very sore for the rest of the day. You'll have to wear a plaster. Yeah, obviously it's gonna be sore, mate. Uh, I won. You probably won on the poo one. Yeah, fair play. We didn't even answer the question. No one in the world can wind me up like Oscar can, and I probably have never fallen out with people more seriously than when I fall out with Oscar. But we always get back together, we always make up. We actually found an interesting fact out about um, twins that they're less likely to get married because they've got companionship already. Okay, next question. From Mimi Dean, judging by her photo, she has a poopy butthole. Do you get separation anxiety? <sighs> no. There was that month we got really upset every time we went to work. But no, we don't actually. I don't think so anyway. We haven't really been separated yeah. for a long time. Never really been tested before. Longest time we've been apart was probably a week, isn't yeah. it? Up nine days, eight, nine days. About eight, nine. Eight, nine, nine and a half. Nine and a half to nine, eight, ten, maybe. Ten max. Mimi Dean was a bit keen and asked us. Mimi Dean was a bit keen and asked us. Mimi Dean was a bit keen. And asked another question. Did you ever wear twin outfits when you were younger? If so, picture it didn't happen. Occasionally, we never really mum and mum. What? I want to say no to that one. I want to say no. You said yes. We had the same coat once. Occasionally. They didn't have two colours. And that is literally the only picture we have of us wearing the same shit. So, <laughs> hope you enjoy. Next question. Do you have 
Twin telepathy. Um, have you seen our TikToks recently? That one. We made one TikTok about twin telepathy. Quite a while ago as well. Go and have a look for it. But, yes. Is the answer. We watched a few twin videos. That question came up in every single twin video. Every single video. And every single one of them lied through their fucking teeth. They go, hmm, not that I know of. No, we don't have it. We never heard of that. No, oh, no, no, no. That's a lie. lie. We want to be honest with you. And what a fucking weirdo doing that with his hat. Every identical twin has it, but they're keeping it a little secret. Next question. I don't about to go whip out a gnarly little Ollie. Can we please cut your hair in a video? Can I please punch you in the dick for a video? It's not quite the same, is it? Well, all right, the answer is gonna be obviously no. The next one is Darcy. When you first meet people, do they ever get your names mixed up? Yes. I haven't really met anyone new recently though. No, when was the last time you met someone new together? I don't know if it does happen actually. It doesn't. We look quite dissimilar, don't we? Trying to when we were younger, yeah. definitely. We looked really alike when we were younger, but we obviously... I'm trying to think of something that people would be able to tell us apart with now. Oh, uh, you've got a mole there. Yeah, I suppose. I've, I've got you this like got... small mole here. From Taylor. Has there ever been a time where your parent or teacher got you mixed up? I literally go like this at my dad every day <clears throat> because he goes like this Luke, Oscar, that's how he says my name as if it's got Lou in front of it Actually, to be fair, it only happens when he's annoyed and it's probably out of habit because he's probably used to tell, like, tell us both of at the same time This is from Marakma What? What did you say? Marakma 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 Yeah What's the most stupid thing people have asked you about being a twin? Um. One time we were doing this YouTube video where we put on our story, asked people to ask us questions about twins, and someone asked if twins have telepathy, which is pretty fucking stupid because no one in the world has telepathy. Telepathy? Yeah, I was te that's telepathy. what I was staring at you for. Oh, telepathy! I said it wrong. Just say the word. Probably. Telepathy. Yeah. Telepathy. Yes. So yeah, that is no offence in me, but that's yeah. The most nah, seriously though, what's the most stupid thing people ask? Oh, if you have the same dick size. Okay, um, who's more of a mama's boy from J-Boys? Uh, it depends what you mean by mama's boy. Mum prefers me, naturally. Well, I think my Oscar's also more dependent on mum. Uh, am I dependent on mum? Um, no, I'm not. More so than I am. In what sense? We don't breastfeed anymore. Weird thing to say. As a 19 year old, is it? <laughs> is it weird? I don't even know if that's weird. Well, Let she's... us know in the comments. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> After dinner, when you... Lie on her lap. Oh, get out of here. You did do it up until sort of like a couple of years ago. I like I lie down after I eat, so when I was younger, I used to just put my head back and lie on my mum's lap. Lie on my mum's lap. I used to finish my dinner. I, I wanted to lie down, so I lie down on my mum's lap. Now, I just get up and I lie on the floor, don't I? Yeah. Sunday roast with the family, I get on the floor. Yeah. I lie on the floor. Yeah. I'm right, fine. You're okay, fine. We, but yeah, I am more than boy. Yeah, 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 you are! <laughs> you are! You are! You so are! So you're like just then? At least I'm not wearing that shirt. Okay, this one's from Chris. My twin bro and I. Hello, twins. My twin bro and I have fights. Almost every time I would win. Who's the stronger slash tougher twin? Lol. Lol. It's not the size of the dog in the fight, it's about the size of fighting the dog. But, I don't know, really. On that front, we are probably literally identical, aren't we? Well, I'd say you're slightly stronger than me. Yeah, but you're tough as hell. He's tough as old, old, old leather boots. Old leather boots. That's my nickname here. Yeah. Old, old, old leather boots, old Luca. Leather boot Luca. Um, um, well, hold on, let me see one, two. One, two, three. Great. Chuck yeah. a hook in there for you. You decide who's the toughest. And the final question is from Jemima Barton. Luca, do you ever get jealous of Oscar? And Oscar, do you ever get jealous of Luca? And if so, why? Thank you for your question, Jemima. What, what a question. How lovely written. How lovely, 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 how lovely written. That's the one. Yeah, that's no. the one. How lovely was that written? Well, how would you say that? What, lovely written? No. <laughs> <laughs> I try and avoid the word lovely because since you're having so much <laughs> trouble with it. Well, how would you say it? How, how nicely well written. written. How well written. <laughs> oh, thanks, your mother. How well written. Seriously, I would say no because we actually... Well, in... Opposite day, is it? <laughs> no, no. Uh, if we're having dinner, there's a mixture of slightly larger chicken thighs and slightly smaller ones. And for some goddamn reason, he's got two large ones and I've got two small ones on my plate. Yeah, I'm gonna be jealous. <laughs> Give me one of the large no, ones. Actually, literally the other night, dinner was being served and on Oscar's plate, 
was this like massive bit of pork and on mine I was it was clearly smaller I was like I came down and before Oscar came down, I was like does everyone see that this is way bigger than mine and mum went they're honestly they're all the same so I went okay I'm gonna swap the plate and I'll put the big one in front of me put the small one in front of Oscar and everyone wait for Oscar to come in and see his reaction when Oscar comes in what did you say goes, what did I say you said something funny yeah it put me on a diet, are you? Something like that. <laughs> Something like that. <laughs> I sat down waiting for Oscar like that. Waiting for him to come in the door. I see him do a little scowl at the table. Look at his plate and he go, Put me on a diet, are you? And that was the end of that. I Wait. chopped off a little bit of mine and gave it to Oscar. Because, yeah, we do get jealous of each other, actually. As jealous as you get of any person for yeah. something that you like about them. For example, I like... His earrings. But I know I'm deathly scared of getting them done. Do you actually want them done? I wouldn't mind A. Yeah. <laughs> I want my nose pierced. I want my nose pierced. Yeah, I, I do. do. Yeah, good. Let's do it. Look, we're going to get your nipples done as well. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, I hope now you know a little bit more about twins. If there's any other things that uh, you want to know about twins, obviously DM us. Snapchat us. We've got a Snapchat, remember. Ba -ding. If you haven't already, we would super really appreciate if you liked this video. If you want to see maximum 15 seconds of us in short bursts of unfunny videos follow us on tiktok more if than you're... anything please smash the subscribe button wait we'll have that being boom click subscribe then click on post notifications okay. road to 1000 road to 1000 let's get 1000 little hoes running around shall we shall we we're the ho twins answering your question about twins, twins. Aviadachi! Mwah!